Good morning. Oh, that's not good. Good morning. 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 We actually, good morning. It's almost afternoon. So we are going on a little bit of a surprise trip. I'm going to be picking up something that I'm not really sure I'll be able to utilize just yet. I mean, I have a few situations where I know for a fact I'll be able to, uh, to use it. And I was able to find a really good deal on it. It's about an hour from here. And hint, I need to take this trailer with me to go pick it up. So let's hope that everything goes well and that we can make a deal. So let's hook up this little trailer and then get on our way. And we are actually bringing both my mother and father just so that they're not bored. And uh, also my father for mm, 35 or so years. So he will definitely help me out in terms of checking it out, making sure that it's Oh, should not have said that. I've said too much. You'll see. All right, let's get this trailer hooked up. Also, as you'll notice, we've got a new jack on this trailer. Uh, there's a little bit of an issue with the jack when it went over to New York to pick up a statue over the weekend. Um, and it, I believe it was uh, unscrewed too far. And uh, the threads got kind of messed up. So we had to get a new one on here. Same exact one, just new because this jack is fantastic. I love this thing. This is my favorite jack just because it's essentially a drop leg for a smaller trailer and uh, it's just super nice. I really do like this jack a lot. Okay, we don't need a piece of wood and most likely we won't need... Oh, I have it on the other side. Most likely don't need this either, but we'll bring it just in case. All right. I believe we're good to go. Wheel shots off, chain, breakaway, wired up, jack lifted, and we're good. So let's go pick up my parents. Actually, we're gonna have lunch at their house first, then we'll go take a trip down to pick up this surprise item. So let's get out of here. And we have to refuel before we head down that way. So we'll have to figure that out. Oh, wait, we'll figure that out. English is hard. We will have to figure that out as well. Fuel costs money. What are we at? Almost a hundred. I think Chevron's gonna stop me at 25 gallons since it's a discounted rate. Yep. Twenty-five gallons, almost a hundred dollars, too much money. There we go. Twenty-five gallons on the dock.
Hey, how's it going? Steve. Donnie, how are you? Great to meet you, man. Right. Pin's still there? I know, but he put them upside down. Yeah. Doesn't really matter right now. We, we just gotta check it out. Oh. Oh, it's on the trailer already. Nice. Yeah, I just leave it on the trailer because I bring it over to the side of the road sometimes. Oh, nice. Park it over there for a couple hours for sale sign, so. Yeah, I can back it off the trailer. You can spin it around and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. There's the little loader. <laughs> I think it's cool too. <laughs> Yeah. I actually use it. I sell these trailers, so I use that one to unload my trailers. Right. And driving this one compared to that one is pretty fun. <laughs> yeah, this is the one I was telling you about. Yeah, it's nice. How much do you sell the trailers for? Five thousand. Five thousand? Yeah. Nice. Seven by twenty-four foot, um, ten and a half k. Twenty-two foot flat, two foot dovetail, fifty-two hundred pound axles. Yeah. Yeah, he sells them. Oh yeah. Yeah. So you sell the trailers, the machines. Nice. <laughs> You got the property for it, that's for sure. Yeah, yep, yeah, anything I can make a dollar on. I wish I had property like this. <laughs> yeah, I'm working on trying to close on another piece of property, actually. That's why I'm like, you know what, anything I can sell. <laughs> right, right, get the cash up together. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's nice. This is a nice trailer, really nice. Yeah, it's pretty stout. My mom, if you want to look at this thing at all before I... Oh, yeah, my dad, bye. Before I fire hey. it up and back it off. Bye. I can back it off first, whatever you want. He said, do you want to check it out first? Before he takes it off? One, zero. Yeah. That's brand new. Yeah, he was saying if you want to check it out before taking it down. I loaded it. Something that could make sense They hate when I keep dreaming I'll be famous But I don't give a fuck, I'ma keep chasing I got all this potential that's deep inside of me But they hate when you're successful cause they try to be They sit there being just mental because you're trying things And they just want you to settle and do the right thing So get a good job, don't slack off Wake up every morning, make a good impression on your boss Don't do anything that I wouldn't do And when you're making money, make sure you don't spend it too soon <laughs> Fuck that, I'll do what I wanna do I got a different path from everyone and that includes you Who are you to tell me how to live life? In these times it feels like nobody's right, yeah So I'ma figure out what else we succeed And then invest all of my time into that and proceed I need whatever the hell could make me happy And I don't think you have a clue what could that be They tell me that I'm never gonna make it They want me to do something that can make sense They hate when I keep dreaming I'll be famous Nice. This one's already oiled up and everything. Like it has, it, it's, it's been topped up with oil and everything. Well, I check oil. It's got oil in it. I would okay. recommend what I did just because everybody else said to do it, which is change out the hydraulic oil. Okay. Yeah, these little machines are awesome, man. Right. Gonna be able to load it? <laughs> Cause that trailer's a little higher. That trailer's a no no no. That trailer's a little higher. No, no no. Yeah yeah yeah. You said more coisa que podemos. You said pois. Oh oh, ran out of gas. No, no, no. Para. 
There you go. Oh, tá bom ou não tá bom? Tá bom. Alright, good. Então vou dizer ao guys se a gente podemos já levar para lá, right? Yeah. Can you already start bringing it over there? Yeah. Like here? Yeah. Bye. Is there like a bill of sale or anything that go that has to go with something like that? No, I can write you one now. I can just give you like a standard. Yeah, you could like email it to me or or message it to me later if you want. Just I don't I'm not familiar with like how that goes, you know. I mean, yeah, there's no title or anything on it, but yeah, I can just give you a bill of sale saying that I sold it to you. Okay, cool. There's a serial number and everything on it. Cool, yeah. cool. Thank you. Yeah, if they ever give you a hard time, I guess you don't know. I don't think you It does not. Uh, so I'll probably drop it down a little bit. Okay. And then my dad's gonna see if he could get it loaded. It, it'll lift itself or no? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. You wanna do this? Yeah, for 30 something years. He retired from. He's a lot smoother than most people. Yeah. Let's jump on. There you go. He's definitely a lot smoother than most people when they first jump on. <laughs> so there's 4,000 in hundreds and the rest in 50s. I'm gonna just take this off real quick for him. Do you want to take a photo? Yeah. Good? Okay. Do you want the envelope? If you want to put it in there. What the heck? Uh, hmm. Oh shit, this is completely taken apart. What the fuck? No, I guess I didn't notice until now, but look, all this is off completely. Hmm. Yeah, it lost. The oh. Hey, não mais mais. Vai bater. The only thing is if the ramps slide off. No, there's no, yeah, there's nowhere to hook them. Yeah, no, this one doesn't have anything for ramps. Do no vice blid.
That was boiling hot. Yeah, that was so hot, it just burned the crap out of me. Holy cow, that hurt. Alright, so there's a couple ways to do it. I mean, you can either try using the ramps like that, or we can put it back on my trailer. And then it'll unload from my trailer to your trailer ah, really easily. Because my dog, yeah. Um, e that's up to you. I can, pull, I can pull a truck around and grab yeah. it. I don't want it to be a pain in the ass. I mean, it's up to, if this don't work, yeah, that's not yeah. going to work like that. Or, um, do you have a culvert when you get home? I'm thinking about when you get home. How you gonna unload it? If you have a culvert or something. Yeah, like yeah, we have culverts. Yeah. I was yeah. Gonna say, if you have a culvert, you go back up to it. Yeah, I think so. The problem is that these ditches are steep as heck. So yeah, they are. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to get it. I was thinking the same thing. Yeah. I was thinking, we'll definitely be able to get it off. Oh yeah, these are super steep. Fuck. Yeah. Here we wouldn't be able to use the culvert, but yeah, that's why I'm just thinking. Yeah, the culvert's super sure steep. Yeah. No, we'll figure it out. Oh. There, at home, we'll definitely figure out a way. Okay. Well, then I'll grab a truck. Um, pull this thing up a little bit. I'll yeah, yeah. Truck, and um, I'll grab that trailer. And I'll just, we'll just do it out here. It'll be okay. Better. It'll be easier than. I appreciate it. Thank you so much, man. Yeah, I'm going to pull. No, no, no. It's too steep. It's too steep. He's going he's gonna to get a truck, hook up the trailer, bring the trailer out. We're going to put the ramps across the two. And yes. Okay, yeah, okay. Alright guys, you saw it. We have our own little mini excavator. You see it back there? It's back there on the trailer, baby. So now, we'll have to learn how to use it get whatever liability insurance we need for it and uh, start renting out that bad boy uh, we're gonna probably rent it um, yeah we'll probably rent it out just as as is but uh, my father is actually an operator so a heavy machinery operator so I we could actually rent it out with an operator and then that way my father will make a few you know few dollars uh doing what he's done for the past nearly 40 years so let's see how that goes and thank you along uh, again for coming along for the ride uh it was a short one uh it started raining which is why i wasn't able to get any more footage while we were down there we were having some issues loading it up so uh the guy that sold it to us actually put it back on his trailer and then backed his trailer up against mine and then we were able to move it from one trailer to the next uh, without too much issue so shout out to him and uh yeah we got a new a new toy added to the uh to the fleet here right now we're keeping it on the trailer and just parking it over at our house and then uh you know probably tomorrow we will uh, bring it over to the yard and kind of straighten out the yard a little bit level it out and kind of Start getting trained up on the thing. So I appreciate you and I'll catch you tomorrow. Peace I won't stop till they hear me now I won't stop till I wear the crown I swear to God they don't let me